Welcome to Cooking for Dummies with Jur. And today we're going to make French toast, or in Dutch, Wentelteefjes. And if we translate that literally, it means wallow witches. Okay. So, what do we need to make Wentelteefjes, or French toast, or wallow bitches? Well, first of all, we need to have uh, the necessities, and that is a stove, a frying pan, a spatula. Actually, that's about it. Then the ingredients. We need uh, preferably white bread, uh, but actually any kind of bread will do. We need uh, butter, we need cinnamon to cover the French toast or lentil tafes or wallow bitches with. And we need uh, eggs, about four, and we need milk. Okay, first we're going to break the eggs. Okay, the eggs are broken, but now we have to stir them with this thing. And it has to be done really well. Okay, the eggs are done. Now we're going to add the milk and it has to be quite much because we're going to make a lot of venteltefjes or French toast or wallow bitches. It all has to be stirred really well with this thing which I maybe forgot to mention. And if I did forget to mention it, that means you will have to go to the supermarket or your local hardware store to get one. It is one of these things. Okay, just mix it well, so it will look a bit like this. Now we're all set to go, so now we're going to fry our rental tafjes. I'm using a Teflon pan, so that means that I use a wooden spatula. The stove has to be very hot, actually the pan has to be very hot. Because otherwise the rental tafjes will get a little bit uh, mushy. And they have to be nice and crispy of course. Okay, well the butter is hot, now we're going to dump or dip the bread into the whatever this is called. This should be nice and well done. And I'm doing four pieces at a time. Well, maybe three. <laughs> yeah, three pieces it is. Okay, so now the sandwiches are in the pan. One side we fry just a bit. And we turn them over with the wooden spatula. And then we're going to fry the other side. Okay, after the initial heat we're going to temper it just a bit. Otherwise they are going too fast and the vental tafjes still stay wet on the inside and we don't want that. So from 9 we put it now to 7. We turn them over one more time just because this is the first batch. And I want both sides to be nice and crispy. Okay, they are fried. They're nice and brown. So we take them out of the pan and then we cover them with sugar.
not too much it's depending on what kind of a sweet tooth you have just nice because it is a sweet breakfast dish also very good for hangovers and then we take the cinnamon and we sprinkle them freely can be nice and much because that is what makes the taste okay and here we have Wentelteefjes or French toast or wallow bitches.